Hey everyone, welcome to the Happy Cancer Tarot channel. All right, let's go ahead and let's get started. This is going to be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Looks like there could have been some issues around money, delays around money. Yeah, yeah, that was the past. Yep, look, evil eye. You got the past energy is showing that there was some sort of evil eye, ill will. But I feel like it was causing delays in your life. But look, answer prayer. That's nice. That's really nice. This says here, answer prayer. Because in the past, you were dealing with delays. You were dealing with blocks. When it comes to your finances, for some of you, this could have been your help. I feel like there's a past life evil eye for some of you that carried over into this life. With this energy that's showing up. But I'm seeing here, obviously, an answered prayer for you guys. What else? For some of you that have been looking for help, praying for help, desiring help. Um, yeah, see, delay. You have here a message. It says snail mail. Incoming news. You, it says incoming news, so you guys can see. Some of you have been praying for this. You've been praying for help. But I feel like you're not the only one praying. There's another person connected to you that's also praying. There's two people here. Hmm. Okay. We'll keep going and see what happens. But you have some sort of... See, a little blessing. Unexpected. You have a blessing coming your way. And it's unexpected. There's some sort of communication coming in. You There's also going to be some sort of news because it says I know we're seeing like newspaper there could be something significant about rural news for some of you some of you may be praying for the rural or praying for something as it pertains to the rural or someone or your family members in other parts of the world you could be praying for them as well but I'm seeing here blessings an unexpected blessing we also have here unexpected visitor coming your way too. It says visitor, stranger, unknown. But this was showing up in reverse. What's up with this visitor? And show it, so is love. Love right here is showing up in reverse as well with this person. Hmm. This is... Let's see what that's about. Tell me about this visitor. You guys got a visitor coming. I'm going to look into your blessing as well. You have here a visitor and this message. What is this visitor about? It just caught my attention because it was in reverse. And it says here a stranger. Someone unknown. So this is someone that you don't know. And we got love in reverse. I feel like there's information attached to this visitor around their feelings. There's something, because this is a book right here, and it's in, it was in reverse. Unexpressed love from a stranger. Look, surrendering. Surrender. There's a visitor, a stranger, someone you don't know, or someone you, for some of you, maybe you know them, but you don't know them like that. It could be just someone you see in passing or someone you talk to casually, but not in a romantic way. Although they have these romantic feelings for you that they have not expressed. They are going to show up because it says visitor. And it feels like surrendering. Surrendering to these feelings. Surrendering to this love. That's why it's in reverse. Okay, sorry about that. Let's see. Who is this person? Now keep in mind... Visitor, stranger, unknown. Feelings haven't been expressed. Someone you could be friendly with. Feels like there could have been another person in the picture with this Three of Cups showing up. We got the Magician coming in. Hmm, tell me about this visitor. The Six of Wands. Whoever this person is, they're popular. 
they're a popular person. Maybe they do something that gets them a lot of attention. But there's something that they're hiding. I do want to tell you that. So there, there's, there can even be two sides to this person. Like there's a public, there's this public persona around this person. But then there's another hidden side to them. Something um, that they don't show the public. The Page of Cups. And then we got here the Queen of Pentacles. Hmm. They're coming in as the Page of Cups. I told you they have feelings for you. But they have not said anything. Yet. Because it says here, Stranger Unknown Visitor. They have not said anything yet. Keep in mind, like I said, this is someone you don't know. Or if you do know them, you and this person don't have a, a relationship, a romantic relationship. It's casual, platonic, friendly. But they are they have a crush on you. Whoever this person is, they have a crush on you. There's something about you that they see. There's something very special about you that they see. Hmm. I want to know what is it that they see. There's something about you that they see that they uh I feel like you're like you're like a modest person. That's they see you as someone modest, someone that's casual, someone that is very earthy, grounded. Maybe you're holistic, you're organic, you're natural. You have caught this person's eye. They have a crush on you. You have a secret admirer. And how you will know this person? They're actually uh, known. Rather, they're famous or... Because that sounds like... I feel like this is someone... Like they do something that gets them attention. So it feels like they're out in the community or out in the public. Or maybe they have like a social media uh, presence somewhere. I'm just getting here like a popular person. Maybe they're um, they have some sort of specialty. But there's something about you that has caught their attention. Something luxurious about you. Something kind and generous. Yeah, we got here woman. You or the current a person you know, girlfriend, fiance, spouse. That's what they see. Spouse. They see a spouse in you. So it's like when they see you. They have recognized you as their spouse, past. You may share a past life with this person. Both of you have been praying. There's been an evil eye in the past too. Even if you've been with them in the past, there was an evil eye um, energy in the past. Both of you have gone through some things. With this answer prayer, both of you are in need of prayer or you've been praying, you're in need of help. You both experienced delay. I feel like this person wants to come towards you. They really want to come towards you, but there's a lot of fear. There's a lot of fear with this person in approaching you because they have not met someone like you. You're very mature to this person. They see you as someone very mature different that that energy has been coming through a lot with you catching someone's eye and them just being like in awe of you see look at here this is a lion but they're sitting there even right here they're just watching from a distance this is someone that watches you from a distance not making their move they're having to overcome difficulties that's why they're not moving because remember we talked about difficulties. This person has to overcome some sort of difficulty. Yep, see they're not very stable right now. Because it says stable, enduring, solid, steady, restrained, secure, long lasting. I feel like this person is busy working to have something stable because they're a page to a queen. They see you as someone who's already stable. 
They feel like you may have your life together, whether you feel like you do or not. This is how they see you because they are watching you from a distance and making these judgments about you from a distance. This person is very artistic. Very creative. They may be an artist or they may be into art. Uh, or like poetry. They may be good at poetry. Like writing poems or um, they're into that. They're very romantic. But they're, they are going through a metamorphosis. They're, they're having to reinvent themselves. This could be, oh yeah, look at here, the Page of Cups, and then here comes the King of Water. Hmm. This person got big feelings for you. That's why love is in reverse. They're, they're, remember I told you there's two sides to them? They're going to come showing you when they do finally open up. They're going to come show you this Page of Cups energy, but really, they're the, uh-oh, they're the King of Cups when it comes to you. See, the Moon card is right here. Hiding it. They have big feelings for you. But they don't want to just open up and tell you all these big feelings. They're really the king of cups. In love. They're going to show up as crushing and interested. Wanting to take you out on a date. Court you. But really this person is actually in love. This is someone that's very gentle. Someone that's very sweet. Emotional. Kind. But they have not made their move. All right. So let's go ahead and see um, about this incoming news for you. And you got blessings. So we're going to move this over here. If um, something comes up, I'll go back over there to it. But let's see. Yeah, they're just, they're, they're coming. They're trying to make their way. But there's definitely some hesitation with this person. But let's see. Tell me about this incoming news. This this message. Oh, okay. So two cars is coming. Ooh, the lovers. It's coming over here. It's coming over here. There's multiple lovers coming in. Cancers, you have multiple lovers coming your way. I'm seeing the Queen of Wands and the King of Pentacles. Okay, then we got here the High Priestess. That's that secret lover. Tell me about this incoming news. Look, luxury. Luxury in reverse. Hmm, what's this incoming news about? earth this is about money it says here virgo capricorn taurus and remember we saw here the king of pentacles and the queen of wands so there's something here here's the sun part here's the eight of pentacles that is that earth energy what is this about this has something to do with love who is this Tell me more. Who is this? Breaking point. So, see, I told you, the person that works for the community. The person that works for the works for the community or is popular. Look at here. Race to victory. They've been busy. Deadlines. Didn't I tell you they were trying to become stable? That's what that incoming news is about. Someone is giving some sort of news monetarily. They've been focused, becoming stable because they see you as being stable. They want to match that energy. The King of Pentacles. This could be a Virgo Capricorn Taurus or just this person being in that energy, focusing on their career, focusing on their work. They've been busy focusing, committed, committed to their craft. Committed to this project. They may have some sort of community project that they've been working on. Having to reach a deadline. So they had to focus. So that's why they didn't make themselves known to you. Because they had to focus. But I'm seeing here fragile and breaking point. Being away from you is becoming too much. 
That's where that prayer is coming in. There's other lovers coming in though. I'm picking up a fire sign. I'll see in a second what that's about. But because it feels like some sort of message around uh, victory. Because it's like they're in this King of Pentacles energy. Some sort of message, some sort of, whether it's a promotion or money or, you know, reaching that point because they've been working really hard. But I'm picking up something around a secret lover or just someone like it feels like it could be an ex. And this ex feels like a fire sign, though. That's secretly watching. Someone's ex is secretly interested in what their ex is doing, whether that's your ex or... Or this person's ex that's secretly watching to see what they're doing. Because it looks like there's a come up. I feel like the position that this person is in, they were not in that position. It feels like a level up, an answered prayer. And I really feel that this person wants to bless you, spoil you, because they feel as though they didn't give to you properly because of a delay. They had to delay coming towards you let's see what else is coming in here i'm gonna go with this i'm gonna take a few cards uh, tell me more about this incoming news See, we got here a hot mess. The unseen. Then I say a secret ex. Someone, there is someone in the background that's a hot mess. Working behind the scenes. And look at it says here. The blessings you don't see. Magic happening. Prayers being answered. Someone is mad. Someone ex is mad. They're a hot mess because they're seeing this person... Who was, who was just a page get promoted to a king or a queen, right? They're seeing that promotion take place. And there's jealousy with that. They're a hot mess over it because they're watching someone manifest. It's like someone's dreams are about to come true, but, but, but they're about to live those dreams with someone new. Yep, see a snake. Didn't I tell you? Jealous. Jealous. Someone's a snake. Yeah, and look, they could have been trying to do something to cause delays. So that the, to, to try to um, hinder, secretly do something to hinder this person, to hold them back, to block them. But a prayer is, yeah, look at here. Someone that they ended it with, death. And this person is going through a transformation, going from the page to this king. Because look, here comes a rare opportunity. And also this connection for you, them with you, one of a kind love. And there's that devil that was interfering. We got marriage and karmic justice, wrongs being made right. Whatever was happening with this devil, spirit, say I'm asking the prayers, karmic justice, wrongs being made right. New partner, maybe divorce. It says attracted to married person or marriage life, attracting a long-term partner. Didn't I say that with that King Queen of Pentacles? They see you as their spouse. They see you as their long-term partner. That's why they felt like they had to get ready. They weren't ready when they met you. But knowing that they wanted something serious with you, I had to get ready. You're the queen of pentacles. I need to be a match. I need to be that king of pentacles. So this person could have been avoiding you or delaying communicating with you because they were trying to get ready. This is what they were doing. Focusing on their goals. Trying to hurry up and complete some sort of goal. Some sort of project that would get them ready in order to be able to be with you. Now here comes the visitor. Now they're ready to come towards you. Anything cancers need to know about this evil eye from the past. And I'm going to see how this is going to be a blessing for you. 
see free that evil eye from the past breaking free breaking free freedom unleash the inner beast that's what i'm saying you're breaking free from it's weakening that evil eye from the past for some of you that was carrying over to from to from previous lives to this life whatever it is you're breaking free it has no hold on you it has no hold that's what you need to know about it that's why it's showing up to let you know there was ill will but there's also protection you're also breaking free now. And then we got here a good omen. See, the evil eye was a bad omen, but Spirit is saying we have a good omen for you now. This prayer, answer prayers. This is a good omen. That's why I said this person is actually um, being sent to be your each other's answer prayers. <laughs> That's what, you are each other's answer prayers. But you may not even see that. The two of you may not even see that you are each other's answered prayers. A good omen. Calm. It says here, monogamy, stamina, baggage, burdens, feeling cursed, guilt, shame, regret. This is a good omen, but someone is feeling cursed because of the past. That's why Spirit brought it up to let you know you're free from those things of the past that was holding you back. See, take off. You can't be held back now. This is a good omen here. This is an answer prayer. And I feel like this person, someone feels the, feels guilt for putting it on hold. For not coming sooner. For not revealing their feelings sooner. And for whatever it is that they were dealing with, there was something going on, like I said, with this ex. Let me see why they're showing up. Because why are they even showing up? I mean, we know that they're a hot mess in the unseen. Spirit, can you tell us why is this person is even relevant to this reading? Let's you. I'm, I'm going to use this deck. Why are they relevant to this reading? We got here Diva. This whoever this person is, they're coming as the Queen of Wands. They could be famous in their own right, or successful, or popular. They could also have like a public platform as well. They may be someone famous. But I feel like um, they're in ruin. Yep, they want a second chance. That's why they're um, showing up because they want a second chance. Because remember I told you this person is coming up. That's why. And remember they were trying to cause a delay. So you're being told this. Because maybe it's a part of this story and when you and this person talk, you need to know. Because I feel like they were not entertaining this person. Not like that. Because they were over here committed to this project. Yeah, see, this is why you need to know. You know why? Because of this. They were doing black magic. Someone doing black magic. Look. Revenge. Forcing justice. That's why you need to know about that Queen of Wands. Witch doing black magic, vengeful out of spite. You know why? Because this person was not paying them any attention, they were not getting paid any attention. They didn't want them anymore. They wanted you, they wanted you. See the X factor someone still caught up with an X, needing to X people out that are toxic praying for help because this person was trying to force it force the relationship a bully right so they were doing black magic stripped and cleansed you are being purified by spirit spirit saying you are being you and this person are being purified by spirit the two of you are each other's answer prayer the two of you are each other's answer prayer this is a good omen. Look, they're coming. Some of you, they may ride a motorcycle bike. Or they may be someone that's very adventurous. They may come across as someone that could be like revolutionary, rebellious to, uh, to some sort of extent. But they're coming in. It says love interest, angry person, new love. They were mad that they were held back. That's why they feel like I got to hurry up. I got to hurry up and make things right. 
they're coming your way. Hmm. I'm seeing here a very, uh, there is some lustful energy with this person too when it comes to you. Anything else you need to know? We have, see karma. You slash their time has come. So whoever this person is, that's why they're a hot mess because they're getting their karma. That's what you need to know. Whoever was doing this to you and this person is actually getting their karma. Their time has come. That's why they're a hot mess. Feeling miserable and unhappy. They were being irresponsible and they're now getting their karma for what they were doing. All right. So let's see what's next for you and this person. Yep. Yeah, see, wants you back. This is someone that wants you back. Dark night of the soul. So we got here in this dark night energy preparing for union. I feel like this dark night, yeah, afraid. Yep, this person is afraid because they're coming your way and they feel like it may be too late. This deadline, rushing. That's why they're rushing. That's why they're angry too because they were held back and they feel like it wasn't fair that they were held back. They feel like they were held back. Intentionally, something was going on to interfere and hold them back. We got here having a baby. Someone could have maybe said, oh, I'm having a baby. Or someone could have been using kids. Um, using something around that type of energy, baby, to distract and delay someone. That's why that dark night of the soul was there. Because this person, it says, don't let love blind you. See, I feel like you were being blinded with this dark magic, smoke and mirrors. I feel like this is someone that you would be better off um, spending quality time with. If this is someone you're interested in, just to see how you feel. Because I feel like when you spend time with this person, you will know for sure what you want. Yep, the gates of love are open. They mirror you. This is someone that's like you. That's what I'm saying. It'll be important to actually get to know each other and spend quality time together without any interference or outside influences. Yeah, because see, there was obstacles blocking this connection, trying to come in between the two of you. All right, so um, that is going to conclude our reading. I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.